afternoon everyone and welcome to a new video on the channel. It's Thursday the 16th of September 2021 and tonight I'm heading up to Easton Colliery for their local derby against Horden Community Welfare in Northern League Division 2. Now you may be noticing that my surroundings are a little bit different and that is because I have now moved into my student accommodation in Middlesbrough ahead of my master's degree at Teesside University. Apologies that there was no video last night, as I said that there would be. Uh, basically, um, in order to get into the building here, you've got to have some sort of like special, basically some sort of like special device that lets you, that lets you in. And unfortunately, man, wasn't working properly. So if I had gone out, I wouldn't have been able to, to get back in or anything like that. You know, because that late night, there's not going to be any staff around and stuff like that. But anyway, the issue is now being resolved. Uh, we are good to go tonight. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Let's get into it. Right, so here I'm in Eton Colliery, despite one of the worst journeys I've ever had to a football match. Um, basically, obviously that train I showed you showed you me getting on at Middlesbrough stopped for ages and ages just out, just outside Stockton before it was eventually turned back towards Middlesbrough because nothing was moving in front of it um, then I've had to get an Uber from Thornaby station all the way up here um, this must be the only country in the world where you can do like a three or four hour journey as I did on Saturday relatively hassle free but one that's only meant to take what 25 minutes ends up being a massive problem um just don't get it but anyway going into this game um like easington are ninth in the table i think they've played 11 games uh Horden, meanwhile started very well and they're up in fifth um you know that, um considering they've only just come into this league from the wayside league you know they've made a pretty good start but you know certain derby days you know form goes out the window a little bit so it'll be interesting to see just how this game goes tonight I've, I'm expecting a good turnout and hopefully it will be you know hopefully the people of this part of County Durham you know get behind the fixture and it's it's a good turnout and just a good atmosphere as well. Well here yeah, come easy and call it the pitch still waiting on Horden. Here come Horden on the pitch and the game is underway and a chance no Oh! oh! This touch is a bit heavy there. Oh, he's done him. Oh! Oh! Oh, that is a great goal, that. That is class, that. Oh, oh, they'll have to go there, there like two days notice. Oh! Half time, Eason Colliery 2, Horton Community Welfare 0. Um, Eason's game plan is, you know, coming off of them here, I mean, at the start of the game, you know, they were quite direct, um, still are to a degree, you know, um, but Horton just aren't dealing with a long ball whatsoever. Um, I mean, the first goal was really well taken, the second one took a bit of luck, but that's just the way it goes sometimes, isn't it? Uh, Horden are trying to, you know, they're trying to play football, but like just aren't creating any chances at all really. Um I mean there's the one early in the game which keeper thought to tip over and 
was one where they hit the side net and bothered and that, you know, really not being that effective at all. Um, I mean, when it's 2-0, you know, the next goal is always very important. I mean, if he's going to go 3-0 up, you know, that'll, you know, that, that'll be game over. But if Holden get get back into this, then they'll, I think they'll, you know, start to dominate a bit and, you know, ease it and could be cl- clinging on. Uh, so makes for a very interesting second half. Let's see how this goes. Oh. Oh. Oh! 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 Okay, I've got some fun. Oh! That's what I'm doing. He'll grasp the cuddle. Oh! But there's going to be three minutes of added time at the end of this game. Someone's being sent off. Is that an easy player? A home player? He's in. Oh, Miri, yeah. shut up! <laughs> yeah, he's going to finish in the game with 10 men. Oh! Full time is in Colliery 3, Holding Community Welfare 1. Uh, good game for the neutral and a good advert for the Northern League, I thought, there tonight. I uh, thought Easington definitely got what they deserved on the night. You know, I thought you know, they were much stronger, you know, created the better chances, etc. You know, so thoroughly deserved win for them. Um, seems to have a lot of luck on the channel, that lot, don't they? I mean, that's three times I've seen them since they started YouTube, um, they've won 5-2 against Jarrow, 3-1 against away at Tower 1, now 3-1 in a local derby against a team that they're below on the table, so um, as I say, like, at this rate, you know, they're probably going to be offering me free seasons to get some free travel to all their away games, aren't they? Um, but yeah, you know, you know, thoroughly deserved by them tonight, it was a good game and, uh, you know, really good turnout as well which was which was good to see right so that's that for this video i'll be back on saturday with gateshead against bradford park avenue in the fa cup so looking forward to that one until then take care and i will see you later